Hello everyone! Today's story, today's cool story, is about Postman Pat. Postman Pat wins a prize. On Monday, Postman Pat called on Reverend Timms. What are you doing? said Pat. I'm getting my stamps ready for the show, said the Reverend Timms. I haven't got a stamp collection, said Pat. Pat drove along the twisty twiny roads and he never crashed. On Tuesday, Pat called on Miss Hubbard. What are you doing? said Pat. I'm getting my bees ready for the show, she said. I haven't got any bees, said Pat. Pat drove on a muddy road and he never got stuck. On Wednesday, Pat called on Dorothy Thompson. What are you doing, said Pat. I'm making a cake for the show, said Dorothy. I'm not much good at making cakes, said Pat. Pat drove through narrow gates and he never scratched his van. On Thursday, Pat called on Ted Glynn. What are you doing, said Pat. I'm making a model train for the show, said Ted. I'm not good at making models, said Pat. Pat drove along the back roads, but he never got lost. On Friday, Pat called on Granny Dryden. What are you doing? said Pat. I'm making lace mats for the show, said Granny Dryden. I couldn't make lace mats if I tried, said Pat. Pat had a huge bag of letters and he delivered them all on time. On Saturday it was time for the show. They were all going to try and win a prize. Are you going to the show? said mm -hmm. Sarah. Well, I don't know, said Pat. What can I do to win a prize? There's nothing I can do. Don't be daft, said Sarah. Why? said Pat. Of course there is something you can do, said Sarah. What? said Pat. You can drive, said Sarah. You drive your van every day. You drive it on twisty, twiny roads and never crash. You drive it through mud and it never gets stuck. You drive it through narrow gates and never scratch it. It's my job, said Pat. I know, said Sarah. But you can go in for the driving competition in your van. I'll have to ask the boss, said Pat. Well, ask him, said Sarah. So he did. The boss said, it's a great idea. So Pat went in for the driving competition. He had to drive along twisty twiny roads. He had to drive through mud. He had to drive through narrow gateways. He had to find his way without getting lost. He did it better than anyone else and he won first prize. Well done, Pat.
Patty. It's only what I do every day, said Pat, smiling. And that's the end of the story. I hope you enjoyed it. Cheerio!